Oh man, I honestly thought New World was done, guys. The numbers were really low, it was super negative, they weren't giving us any good news about the future. And then the console beta dropped and there was a ton of interest in it. All of a sudden the game is picking back up again, people are jumping in and playing again, and there is excitement to play this game again. I'm excited. So, number one, I'm very happy that New World didn't die. Maybe this game can't die. I don't know what its deal is, but no matter what Amazon does, it doesn't seem to be enough to kill it. So yeah, that's that's a great positive. But, number two, we get to have that fresh start experience again. And if you have ever played this game when it came out, or you ever played any of the fresh start servers, you know for a fact that the fresh start experience is the best experience in this game. Not only the leveling process and the beginning game and all of that early open world PvP that you get, but end game is so much better on fresh starts at the beginning because, well, nobody's done end game yet. People have lots of stuff to grind, there's lots of activities to do. I know one of the big criticisms of this game, at least historically, has been that the end game is not as fleshed out as it should be. Well, there's still at least a few months of endgame to do after the fresh start server comes out. So at the very least, until Christmas, I get to enjoy playing New World again. And well, today Throne and Liberty comes out. That's pretty exciting. I know literally nothing about this game outside of it's an MMO and there's the promise of large uh, open world PvP. So yeah, I'll be jumping into it and playing it. It's made by Amazon as well. You can have positive or negative thoughts about that, but I I am looking forward to it. I'm all for these types of games. I love this big, large-scale combat, as you can see in this footage here. So, yeah, hopefully I can make some cool videos, some cool builds for you guys, and share something really soon about Throne and Liberty. But my plan is to jump back into New World and play New World Aeternum. It's just kind of a weird lull right now for the game where we're just waiting for that fresh start. So, I don't really have anything to do on my Iron Man. So yeah, that's basically the plan for the channel going forward right now. Um, and well, let's talk about me. It's been a really long time since the last time I put a video out, the last time I streamed for you guys. Um, and this past year and a half or so has been super inconsistent. I haven't put out a lot of content. I haven't streamed very consistently either. I have been working. I got various different jobs and just trying something different with my life. I think after New World kind of went in the dumps, I didn't really know if I wanted to keep pursuing this. Um, but after getting back out there and seeing what my options are as a person in the world, <laughs> I want to keep trying to do this. This is a really fun job and I have a great opportunity to try to make it happen. So I'll do my best to put out as much entertaining PvP content as I can for you guys. In my personal life, I have gone through a lot in the past few years, and um, the past two years, a big reason why I haven't put as much work in as well is I've been taking a lot of time to get physically and mentally healthy again. I was very sick for a long time, it took a big toll on my body and on my mind too, so... You know, I don't love talking about that stuff, but uh, I'll at least be honest with you guys, things were pretty fucked up for a while, so I'm doing a lot better now. I'm in the best physical shape I've ever been in my life. Mentally, I feel better than I've felt in years. And I'm excited to jump back into streaming again, to just be playing, just out there PvPing every day. That's honestly one of the biggest things for me in these games, is not just the excitement of PvPing, but seeing the improvement from day to day, from week to week, seeing how I can slowly get better and better. Always a really good thing for those games, and uh, something good for your brain, I think. Anyway, I'm getting off topic here. I just want to say, welcome back, everybody. I know that uh, my show's kind of sucked a little bit lately, but this is me committing to making that show a lot better for you guys. So again, I hope to see you live if you come and watch that. If not, stay tuned to the channel, and uh, I'll keep more videos coming out for you soon. Otherwise, have a great day, everybody, and I hope to see you next time.